The May strategy is providing alternative solutions to transportation that outperform personal car ownership. One of the things we've learned from customers is that they don't actually want robo-taxis. They want transportation systems that are integrated in with their public transit systems. And that's really important for improving equity and access and improving the quality of people's lives. So we work with public transit agencies, departments of transportation, government organizations to really figure out where are some of those mobility or transportation gaps and how can we help to really fulfill some of those gaps by really complementing their existing mobility ecosystem. We're saying, look, we're going to do level four autonomy at this site on these roads. The really hard part about getting autonomous vehicles is not getting the vehicle to sort of nominally drive itself. The hard part is how do we know when we're done? How do we know when this vehicle is safe enough? That's a big deal. I think it's the biggest deal in this industry. As May and Applied have worked together over the years, we've used more and more of their tools and the tools have become more integrated into our own processes. The Applied tools work very well with ours because we have this sort of code layer in between. Whenever anyone commits new code in the May repo, we have checks on that. We have simulation tests that run. So being able to do the first set of tests in simulation is a huge, huge bonus. With Simeon, we can set up an artificial scenario. And that's just crucial. In a broad array of cases, what is the vehicle going to do in this situation, in this situation, in this situation? Logstream is useful because it lets us sort of replay our own data and sort of re-simulate. Okay, the vehicle drove and the driver intervened. Okay, what would have happened if the safety driver had not intervened, right? That's a question we ask ourselves a lot. Um, and we can answer that question with Logstream because if we can show that the vehicle will do the right thing in these various situations, then that's a huge part of making the case that this is safe enough. One thing I think that's really important for people to know and the industry to know about AVs and how they'll develop is right now they're cutting edge. They're really exciting. Eventually, they're going to need to be transportation. And so we're on this journey to go from really cool high tech to something that changes the world but is maybe not as glamorous. And I think May is on that journey and I'm so excited to be on it, but it's so important to work with cities and transit agencies so that we go on that road together and that we make sure that AVs reach their full promise and potential. We'll know that May is successful when we can look at cities and see that they're built for people and not cars.